Hey everyone, so I wanted to show, for those of you who aren't sure how to create, um, I don't know, to do HTML and to create a pop-up uh, using an image as a click-through for uh, an offer. Let me just show you how to do this real quick. It's pretty easy to do. So um, this is the web page that I'm going to be using for this demonstration. I've been using this um, in a real a campaign that I'm doing. I'm just going to show you exactly how to do it. So the first thing that you need to do is create the image, and I showed this in a different uh, in a different demonstration before. But I'm just going to keep some of this background in here. I'm just going to basically try to make this look as uh, I don't know as nice as I can, just grabbing this information, get it nice and even here. All right, and I'm going to I'm going to capture the image. And then I'm going to save this down to my desktop. Um, yeah, so I guess I already have one saved here. So let me just go ahead and use the one that I have saved from before instead. But that's how you save it. I'll go ahead and cancel. And uh, okay, so the next thing that we need to do is we need to come in here and add a campaign. And I'm going to call this campaign Crisis after. Uh, the name of the product, which is it's at foodcrisis.org, right? And so the destination URL you can pick anything. I'm just going to send them to for the purpose of this uh, demonstration, just to my own blog. But you could send them to any article, political article somewhere, okay? And then you choose option two, and this is the HTML editor, and it's you can also do this using the visual editor um, but I use HTML just because it's easier for me personally but what, what you're gonna need to do is you're gonna go to the media tab and add new media and I'm gonna just pull directly from my desktop that image you can see I'm dropping it here it's gonna upload that image for me and then all I need to do is come down here and uh, grab this URL. Okay, you can see the dimensions right here. So just remember those dimensions. I'm using uh, Google Chrome browser, uh, and I have this set up so that I can open up a new tab by middle clicking. Um, middle clicking on a uh, on my mouse so I'm going to open that campaign up I think I canceled that campaign so again I'm going to call this crisis and I'm just going to send them to my blog I'm going to open up this campaign go to the HTML editor and I'm going to put this in here ahref equals and then this, this is the image image source equals and then the close uh, link tag so this is opens the link this closes the link and then uh, so this is basically a link wrapped around sorry wrapped around this image so if anyone clicks on this image it will go to this link okay so we have to put our link in here the link that we're sending them to is my affiliate link for the ClickBank product. So I went to ClickBank, I found a product through their marketplace, and I just copied, uh, I got the link for it. Okay, so I'm going to put that link right inside of this href tag, and then I need to find this image. Um, so where can I get this image? Again, the URL is right here. So I'm just going to copy this and paste it right into this between these two um, quote marks and that's pretty much it for this um, now we need to go down and set the width and height as you can see the the width is 909 pixels set that here well I'll just type it in then 909 and the height is 640 pixels now we'll go ahead and save this I'm going to test it out. 
by clicking here. And this sends you to my blog and you could read about this article or whatever. And then when you exit out, we get the pop-up. And because I have this thing it's so big, I, I find it here. Let me see if I can make this smaller for you so you can see the whole thing. Um, so this is what they're seeing, then they see this pop-up. Now if you click on this, some people will click just so that they can play the video. And when they do, they're going to be redirected to the actual video page through my affiliate link. And um, yeah, so that's how it's done. Um, yep, so we're good to go now. So anyway, there we have it, guys. Um, that's pretty much how you create a pop-up using an image tag. Let me hop in here real quick. And I'll sh kind of show you how you can do the same thing using the visual editor. It's a little bit difficult for me to show you this because uh, just because of the space I'm working in here. But essentially you can do kind of the same thing. Let me go ahead and just delete this thing out. I'll save this. I'll copy and paste that. Let's close that out and we'll go to the vis visual editor. So there's nothing here. You can see that you can add an image, um, add media. So it'll open you up and you can go from your media library. Or in this case, you can do the same thing. You would just drop it and drag it in there. But since I've already done it, and it already exists in my media library here. So we'll click Show. And then we'll um, insert that. But you got to use the full size. We'll insert it to our post. So there it is. Oops. Now the only th other thing you need to do is click on it and then create a link. Um, I don't usually use the visual editor, so my apologies for being kind of, uh, oh, there we go, yeah. Click on the link, and I'm just going to paste in my affiliate link here, and just hit update. Okay, so that should, should do it. I'm going to go ahead and save it, and I'm going to test it out and make sure that it did do it. I'm going to shrink this down again. Click on my link. Same thing as before. And it's working just exactly the same. Click on it and it takes us through. So there's those are two different ways that you can do this that effectively um, help you create that pop-up very, very easily. So let me know if you have any issues at all.